cat butt. <laughs> hey guys, it's Kelsey. I bet you are wondering what in the heck there are two boxes doing in front of you instead of my pretty face and my two boys. That one's Taylor and that one's Tyler and then Doogie's right here. Doogie, say hi baby. <laughs> So anyway, um, on the right you can see my old makeup organizer and on the left is my new one. Okay, now you're going to be seeing a lot of kitty action here. There's Hallie. Um, so anyway, I've actually thought about getting a new makeup organizer for a while now. Um, but I never actually got around to doing it until this last time I went out of town and my makeup collection has now gotten way too big for my original makeup organizer which is my pretty little homemade box thing. If you watch my video on how to customize and organize um, how to make things cute. Um, you saw this in there. I actually covered this with leopard print duct tape and it's just one of those three drawer organizers. And the reason there's still some makeup in there is because that's makeup that either needs to be thrown away or some that I am pretty confident I will never use again. So. Basically, I had this as my eye drawer, this one was my face drawer, and this was my lip drawer, so my, uh, yeah, my uh, collection has gotten too big for that, and it was overflowing, and all that good stuff, so I decided to move to, dun, 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 this. This is the Luxury Deluxe Wood Cosmetic Box by Lori Greener. Um, this color is in wood, uh, oak, it's obviously wood. This color is called oak, and um, they also come in a white, and a walnut, and a cherry. And the reason I chose the oak one is because, as you can see over here, this is the top, the bottom of my bathtub, and all of my wood pretty much is oak finish. So the oak one goes beautifully with the rest of my decor in my bathroom. So um, basically you can buy these at QVC for $76 and they I think have $11 and some change shipping and handling. There's his cute little face. Hey Dookie. Sorry, getting off subject here. Actually, I got mine off of eBay because I found that I could get this a lot cheaper off of eBay. I bought this for $49 and then paid, I think, $19 something for shipping. So, in total, I ended up saving about $20 on this as opposed to buying it off of QVC. So... Yeah. So anyway, um, this is the front of it. As you can tell, it is quite a bit taller than the three drawer one. It seems like it's just as wide. And then over here you can tell that this one goes back a lot further, but what this one goes back, this one has in height. So you can actually store a good deal of makeup in this one. So I'm fixing to show you and quit blabbering. So this is the top and that goes up. So weird being behind the camera. So there's a mirror right here, nice big one. I like the inside of this because it's like a, it's white but it's not a fabric. It's, it feels uh, not really, I guess it might be kind of vinylish. I'm not really sure what it feels kind of leatherish, but it's not going to stain as easily as a cloth would. So it should be fairly easy to clean up. 
Um, so yeah. Then we have the top here. And I'll go ahead and turn this a little bit so I can see a little better. So there's the top of it. You can just look right on down in there. And then you pull apart this first door and that one. And I'm just going to kind of go through everything just very quickly. There's kind of an overview of everything. And then you can also see what's in the next drawers down. Um, here up top I have a Laura Geller lip spackle and a single Estee Lauder eyeshadow and my sugar lip balm. Then I have three of my Estee Lauder uh, stay, Double Wear Stay in Place cream shadows. Um, then I have mostly my face products. I have an Avon makeup remover lotion. It's my favorite makeup remover. The brush I use to put on my foundation and put on my setting powder. An Estee Lauder Spotlight. You can use that kind of like a highlighter or you can use it underneath your foundation for a primer. MAC Fix Plus Spray. Estee Lauder Double Wear Light. Double Wear Original. Uh, Revlon Color Stay. And... Uh, Makeup Forever Matte Velvet Plus. Now with this one, I am going to mostly use that for my videos because I don't need my makeup to last a really long time for videos and I still want to be able to use it. Um, then here I've got my Estee Lauder Bronze Goddess Soft Matte Bronzer and then I've got my two NARS Multiples in Copacabana and G-Spot. So dirty. <laughs> Then I've got my Maybelline Color Tattoo in Tough as Taupe, a MAC eyeshadow in Pink Freeze that I have not depotted. And then over here I've got a little NARS lipstick in Shiap. It is super, super bright, hot fuchsia pink. Really, really bright. Not something I would probably wear every day. That's why it's kind of off in its own little world, but it's still a very beautiful color. Revlon Lip Butter, uh, MAC Lip Glass, and uh, Viva Glam Gaga. I've got my um, Estee Lauder lipsticks here, two Clinique ones. I've got my MAC, lip, uh, MAC lipsticks here, and Revlon's here, and my new Too Faced one here. Now, coming to the second set of drawers, this actually has three sets of drawers to them. You have one, two, and then the third level. And then down here is your fourth level, too. So, this one I keep my um, eyelash curler, my eyeliners, I've got liquids and um, felt tips and pencils and then mascaras and then I have my seals booster primer that I really really like then over here I've got my MAC mineralized skin finish this is more of a face and primer drawer um, backup one these are both in medium got a sample of the cover effects clear prep matte foundation primer and anti-acne treatment gel so yeah, I got that from Sephora. I actually kind of like this a lot. I uh, got my Hard Candy Glamouflage, the Clinique Pore Refining Solutions Instant Perfector, and Too Faced Shadow Insurance, and my Benefit Erase Paste. So those are the uh, second set of drawers here. Open those up, and here is all my lip products. So I've got a ton of these little squeezy tubes of lip gloss. I've got a ton of the Beauty Rush ones from Victoria's Secret. I've got probably just about every color they've made. And then I have just a random uh, L'Oreal Le Gloss in there. And that color is Violet Attitude. Number 160. Can't really tell. Over here, I've got other lip glosses that are a little more pigmented. I've got two Revlon ones. That's uh, Hot Pink and Orchid. My favorite Bonnie Bell lip gloss, Lip Lights and Mocha Mousse. Um, my CoverGirl Wet Slicks in the 
pink sequin and then I have one in Peaches and Gleam uh, Clinique Chubby Stick and these two Kat Von D lipsticks are in Lovecraft and Lolita and I was unable to fit them into this spot right here because the tubes are too big so I just kind of put them down there and then I've also got a NARS lip lacquer in Hot Wired that is a really pretty fuchsia pink so that's the second set of drawers open it up one more time and you have reached the bottom now down here I love how this has little separators in it so you can really separate little small palettes um, I've got mostly cheek products here an eyeshadow palette from Estee Lauder in Blue Dahlia um, my two tar Amazonian clay blushes NARS blushes and sin and super orgasm uh, Too Faced La Vion Rose blush and then my uh, Urban Decay Baked Bronzer and then I've got two just little random Estee Lauder eyeshadow palettes stuffed in the front. Over here is kind of a miscellaneous drawer um, just different little products that I didn't really know what to do with much um, my Estee Lauder Double Matte Powder a Revlon Color Stay Highlighter a Victoria's Secret Smooth Effects Lip Scrub and Balm, a Smashbox Photo Finish Luminizing Foundation Primer, a Revlon Cream Shadow Palette, and my Kat Von D Lewig Palette, and then a little brush that came with the um, bronzer. So those are just kind of little random products. Then in the back what I love the most is a place to keep all of my brushes. This it's uh, separated a little bit you can kind of tell when I move my finger there's a little separation there so there's actually four little slots right here. I've got um, my Sigma Eyes kit right here so there's actually nine brushes in here because I also have the little double-ended brush from the Urban Decay Naked 2 palette in there and they fit all really nicely in there. Got foundation brush, blush brush, and contour brush and then these are just four different blush brushes so everything fits really nicely. Everything looks just beautiful. I'm gonna kind of arrange it so it looks pretty. So there you have it. It's all kind of you know scattered about. Um, it looks really nice. I really like how beautiful this thing looks because makeup, patch uh, makeup packaging is very beautiful and I like to display it in something that's really nice. So I think this organizer is just beautiful. I hate that not a lot of people talk about this. I haven't seen very many videos on this makeup organizer but it is so beautiful and I hope y'all check it out it's a really great investment because to me your makeup is a great investment so I will be saying goodbye bye guys